Now to breaking news out of Westchester County this morning. Dozens of firefighters are on the scene of a fire in Yonkers. The flames broke out overnight. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis joins us live from the scene with the latest on this story. Jenna? Cindy and Andrew, I was just talking to firefighters who said they just entered the building to make sure that the fire is out. Now I want to step aside so you can see all the damage it left behind. You can see the roof of the building is collapsed. Luckily, Yonkers Fire says everyone made it out on their own. Police are reporting one minor burn injury from the three alarm fire, which was called in after three this morning. You can see the heavy flames shooting out of the four story building on Nepperhan Avenue. About 75 firefighters battled the fast-moving fire. Yonkers Fire tried to fight it from inside the building but were forced out due to the intensity of the fire. The assistant chief said a firewall is keeping the flames from spreading to the left side of the structure. The people we spoke to were just grateful they got out. Thank God everybody is safe. That's, that's what we care about, you know, so uh, the kids and everybody's out. I feel a little scared and upset because I had, like, important stuff. And um, it's really scary going through this because it's my first time going through this. And the cause of the fire is still under investigation, but the chief says he believes at this point that it is accidental, and we are told that the families are being relocated this morning. We're live in Yonkers, Jenny DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. Jenna, thank you.